Kristen Bell and Dax Shepard said they spent 600 on betting to sleep in the Boston airport. Their flight was delayed, and there were no hotels available within 50 miles. The couple posted then. They said they were kicked out of the airport and forced to find somewhere to stay actors Chris and Bell and Dax. Shepard said they spent 600 on pillows, blankets, and sheets so their family could sleep in the Boston airport after their flight was delayed then. They were kicked out of the airport, while the experience might sound like a nightmare to most people. The couple seemed to have an upbeat, go with the flow attitude about the debacle Bell said in an Instagram story on Wednesday that her group, including husband Shepard and their two kids, were stranded at the Boston airport after hours of delays Shepard posted that after seven hours of delays, the flight was kicked to the next day, altogether Bell added that because there were no hotels available within 50 miles, the family decided to sleep in the airport and made the best of it by playing games like Anno and Spades. Shepard also posted a video of the couple joking about how much they each spent on pillows, blankets, and sheets a total of around 600. The punchline is, even though I spent 350 on neck pillows and blankets, I decided to just buy one toothbrush for the whole family to share. Shepard said in the video, laughing while lying on the ground in their makeshift bed of blankets, after they had set up their sleeping quarters and Shepard had already taken his sleeping, M.E.D.S. Bell posted that they were then kicked out of the airport and forced to find somewhere else to stay. Thankfully we found friends of friends who offered us their attics and accepted us at 1 a.m. Bell wrote in a post on her Instagram story and then took us on a hike the next morning with a lot of dogs and it was heaven. It's not clear why they were kicked out of the airport. The Boston airport and representatives for Bell and Shepard did not immediately respond to Insiders requests for comment their story follows a year of travel, nightmares for many people. From thousands of flight delays to being stuck on planes for several hours. Sometimes in sweltering heat, 